Hi buddy, welcome to a new episode and today we're trying something different Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links It's a game that you can have in your app You can, you can have it as an app in your phone Or in the PC from Steam It's free so anyone can play this So I don't think you can expect something like this in my channel and I kinda now trying to do different things because I don't want to be known as a folk YouTuber, but as a dragon tamer to say that I open to other things, not just Pokemon. And this is kind of a showcase of the game. I'm not too much in meta and something like that, I just play to enjoy. Although, if you try to play the actual game, like from Yu Gi Oh! Pro, Percy, man. That. I mean, this kind of is the start, but again, it slowly becomes this too complicated to understand. Like, we're now in the single age, that kind of is close to the end, so next be the Xyz summoning, that I really enjoy. 107 for the best. And today I'm gonna showcase my kind of 3 decks. I mean, I have a thousand of decks, but there's something weird about how they manage and decks. I mean, I have to I have to have a character and his set of decks empty that I can use. Like, for you have one deck and you have to level them up to have more decks to use them for this deck or that deck. And I kind of, I don't know, this is my rant about this. Why do we need to to level up to unlock new deck. I mean, I really sometimes it's annoying that I have to move this deck to other and be oh that this character have these decks and yeah. So my particular main decks, not say that they are the best, just to enjoy to play are the dragons, of course, dinos, vampires, magic trick. Now that I remember and machine kind of and i don't say that they are a hacker type I, it's just a name that i give them and i think we're gonna start with the hmm, machines that i name it transform roll and yeah it's a deck full of machines type Yu-Gi-Oh monster and the game's kind of not working with the obvious actually i get and yeah, I can have a deck around machine deck and how, what I say already, synchro is the age now, to say. And if you want the suggestion, try to obtain the most play cards in the decks, like enemy control, the most play card of all. This card literally annoys me how you see it, but I have to. And another card that kinda is interesting. <laughs> Sorry guys, something literally happened. This is like the first time when I have to actually stop recording in the middle of so where is it? I'm yeah about the most played deck cards and there are a lot of cards that you can I mean you have to have luck to pull the cards up and to be honest I wish I can grind a little of gen to show you how you pull a card. I guess you can battle a couple of times and one at least 20 gems because a uh, booster and I'm gonna show you so let me first let's try the machine deck transform all that mm, I cannot try to work around I mean they have this boss robot boss that you can kind of Summon it uh, using a specific 
You say I want to remove this and actually add a new card. What new card I can add? And this is the thing about you always kind of change your deck. You update your deck because there are some cards that I come and they are the most used. <coughs> And the thing about a suggestion again is to not have, I mean, a thing about monster between 1 and 4, you can normally summon them easy without anything most of the time. Level 5 and 6 requires to tribute one monster. There are some that can be special summon, that, that's another story. And 7 to 12 and to be honest, 12 kind of is for more special summoning that the other cards. But back to 7 to 9 and 10, we call 2 tributing monster. Some 7 and 8 monster require 1. Like a plant monster level 7 can have a... Actually, I have that in my plan deck now that to think, and I'm gonna show you soon. And... I mean, people, I mean, I mean, you can have three copies of any card. And there are some that are limited, something like that. But I want to play with every different card that I can have at my disposal. And yeah, this is not actually machined. 100% It's more like because these cards have a similar name to other cards But I can actually, I can, I better actually make a deck that have them just because Yeah, this is my Actually, how I would destroy this card again? I don't remember Oh yeah, actually this card Needs not because I can only tribute once for yeah. Machine kind of didn't come with newer stuff, so yeah. Oh, come on, game, work with me. So, yeah, you can play with your friends, PvP, and there are these NPC that are, you can actually use them as test that because now that I actually have a really high level because they are really easy to beat they are sometimes really annoying and when do I fight oh yeah you can fight this and try to make a strategy or something like that and yeah I gonna fight the NPC because I don't think I want to showcase now the PvP element yet and here there are ranks, the dual master, no, king master, the ultimate to say, hey, nothing to you, too much. And uh, about the thing about dual links, skills are not kind of part of the games. I mean, now they have speed dueling that is kind of hit or miss to say. So yeah, now he's doing. He has the first turn. He cannot attack me, but he can set up uh, for anything that I may come. And now I come and attack him. And uh, to be honest, I can have a weak monster at the field. He can come with that. But some monsters have an effect in the graveyard. That oh yeah. This is another very used card. Ah, I don't have to think about it. And yeah, there are archetypes you can unify here, but they're not safe because they are not still all the cards. I mean, for Cyber, I think they are, at least for the Man, see the main deck that for the extra that uh, exists. Oh, come on! 
You can at least destroy that gun. And here, some card has an effect right in my hand, like spells. What I can summon with aid? Yeah, you kind of have to think your strategy through off. Sometimes I think a single necessity at a tuna that this is, and any monster and any requirement they need. And this card cannot be destroyed once. So, he say he has too much and attack this, then the effect is no more have effect. Oh, damn it, I forget to... I'm... Um, mute the game. I mean... It's not so much that... I mean, the character attacking when they draw the effect... I have one. Na no, eight, nine. So what I can summon nine? Oh, this guy. Yeah, we somehow you kind of have to calculate your ways on how you use your mass and especially the tuna. Yeah, this is the synchron animation for all. Again, each character have an ace dragon that has his own animation. And yeah, some monsters have effects like this one. When I defeat a monster in the face position, I do a count. And yeah. You can win this by deploy all LP of the adversary to zero. Oh, I can summon. Oh. And now I can summon another synchro. And this is this boy's skill ace. And yeah, this is the ace animation card. And I don't say ace like a character. The ace card. And here's the animation. And this work with the ace of the character, so you can have this animation if you have this card in other character. Wait, the NPC have voice? Yeah, and you can click to skip up the thing. Okay, let's see. Oh. A anyway, let's... There are some answers that can... Oh, what, what I can special summon? Oh, the light one. But... This card, for example, can turn any mass into a tuna, like the tuna represented by green stuff. And 
And this is how you win a duel. And yeah, you win, you gain experience, you level up, you can have new cards, new decks, all gems that are the most important thing to buy boost effect and have new cards. This is my machine deck, Transformer All. Although it's not kind of transforming. Okay, let's go back and switch to... I think I'm gonna showcase just three decks for now in this video. The next one will be the Vampire's deck. I think you guys already see my deck on the Halloween special that I'm gonna play on another one. And yeah, this, my decks are kind of team that actually have to work with the archetype of specific thing. And to be honest, I kind of wish I can obtain a specific card for this deck, like Red Eyes Neck or Dragon. That is my favorite card, I actually have it in real life. Wait, this is necessary to do more, like... Oh, this guy is really not easy to please. Let's make another little change. Let's see, what does the popular cars now? Ah, I didn't put this card. Well, now I have it. And now I can have a space when I'm gonna have a luck and pull out the card. So, this card ha is half vampire, but again, the Halloween theme can be seen with zombies. Okay, let's do a NPC. And again, you have to switch character that is eh, kind of annoying. I mean, I kind of wish they all don't ask skill like is necessity. Like, I think that you can play duel in this format as easy without any skill. Hello Kingdom Yeah, this card You can special summon if you obviously have monsters So I can put it and use it as teleporting for any 5 and 6 months I'm gonna take the heat Ah, perfect, the vampire. I know, I know. Come out. I don't know why that this is my kind of favorite vampire card. No, actually there's the other one. But this is now for now. Um, I kind of have done a oopsie because uh -oh. um,
that that wasn't that kind of fire? No, it's light. Oh, damn it. Yeah. I didn't play my cards right. Oops. Let's try again, okay? And um, yeah, I mean, I don't know how, know how to uh, tell you all the things about. I mean, now like why they are two character. I mean, they are from the seas. I think Yukio was dub in my country season one, but I don't know. This is my actual favorite card, but this is the more useful now. And this one give me better this one because this country is gonna give me a boost or SP if I make the thing try. And vampires again they can take control of Monster if they're defeated, and I can use them for tributing, synchro, and other stuff. Oh no, is trap my trap cards? Oh wait, I can... Oh, I think I done something. I better unlock. And I think I can now use this.
Final blow. And here's my advance. Why do you look sad? What do you want? So this is my vampire deck. I think it's the second deck that I actually use most of the time. And yeah, the duos are kinda fast to say. And there are events and other stuff that can happen. And I think it's now for the main course, my dragon deck. That I'm gonna give you guys a showcase of my deck. This is kinda my ace mindset. White Knight Dragon. It cannot be targeted by spell or spells, but can be affected by uh, monster effects, so... Mm. Interplanetary... blah blah blah... Dragon, that if my monster is destroyed, I can special summon him right away. This guy, I can special summon him and use it in the combo that if I throw this guy and this, this guy can allow me to special summon this guy from the graveyard. This can be used for double tribute without using other monster, and it has high defense, so if I have it in the first hand and first turn, it's really good. This guy is kinda for the boost, like again, use it if I have these cards to send them in the graveyard. One of the most player cards. This card inflict his damage. This he can attack defense monsters. This kind of is a, a, a pre-evolution of this guy, if you can understand my NASA. A tuner that can level up once a monster. This monster that you may have seen is really good, because if I have his setup down, I can activate his effect and special some any dragon monster I have, like this guy. And this have a similar ability. This is a high ache muscle. And I don't kinda use them too much. I mean, a combo to be is to special summon this guy. Although it's a 5, I can special summon him that he has 100 attack. But if I use it and have this in the hand, I can special summon this guy more. And another thing he can summon this other tuna that have for single material and I have a special card that allow me to special summon this without any restriction and I have other monster that I have traps This game can have mechanics with coins, dice, and I think they have with work paper season, I think. And yeah, a strategy is to send this guy first because if I can, I send the other dragons, the effect will not to activate if I do in the other orders. This is really annoying. But again, he can have a bad leg like me.
Oh yeah. Well, this was anticlimactic. I kinda wish I summoned my white knight. But again, you never know how the situation might happen. And I mean, you have to strategize a lot. So don't expect that because you have that card, you're gonna win. Okay, I think I have time for one more deck. What to be, what to be? I think it's a deck. Oh, the, yeah, the magic deck. That kinda I enjoy it too to play sometimes in a while. And by the, that, I guess you can get that it has a lot of trickery to say spellcasters. Oh yeah, here he is. Oh yeah, I already updated the deck. Again, I kind of wish there are another system like you can create, like in the TCG Pokemon, you can create any deck, and no, I don't know, you can manage them to whose decks give. Like I can create my deck and deck and I can assign to this specific uh, character. Will be um ta one thousand, one times better. But I guess they have to make the money. And yes, there are Nicole kinds of transactions here. Oh, but oh wait, I have that can. Oh yeah, I have him. Yeah, they are all kinda stupid to say. At least they actually have the combo, they are not too bright on how to play. Now she's gonna set up cards and until I KO him. why I have this card, the sound mute to this game, kinda the voice kinda gets annoying, uh, what I can activate? Oh, interesting, I never have this sense, but oh well. Yeah, there are tons of monsters with different effects and... What was his thing again? Oh. Well, I guess I better let him have the defense.
so counters can actually work with each other. I didn't know that. Again, you can discover new things with your deck when you update them. Yeah, you have a auto duel if you want just to do this and finish it off. I think this guy is kind of overpowered because I saw people have it in the first hand and um, have the right monster with the high power and really get annoying. At least you have a way to remove it from play. It's not present. How many I can put in this because I'm already 500. It doesn't say a limit. I can have 99 counters on this. There is nothing that I expected. I mean, in Dulix, you never know how the thing will go. Yeah, because of my synchro that can cancel any effects that supposed to happen, is really good. And again, you have Kexa that you can level up. I really have to obtain this card because I can obtain a booster if I use it for synchron. And I have dozen of decks that I don't try that much, like an Aqua deck, Gexi, Fairy, Reptile, any other type of deck. Yeah, I'm gonna have a special series to say where I'm gonna do anything, battle, anything. And this is kind of my deck that I still try to work around. It's not the perfect one, but at least it's fun to say. So, this was my video on DL for Salt Dueling. Hope you enjoy it. If you want to see more, comment down and yeah, we're gonna see you in the next video. Aloha and 10.